welcome back in today's video i am going to show you a cred web app which have ability to upload five files at a time you can add upload multiple files at a time for a same person you can also add new data you can also edit your previous data you can also delete your data so let's check how this work and first we take one examples so if i want to edit my data i just need to click on the edit icon so i am just changing from male to female the gender and click on the update and when i click on the update the data is successfully updated and you can see here the male change to female also if i want to delete the data i just click on the delete icon and just delete it okay when i click on the yes delete it the data will be deleted from my database you can see and if i want to add a new employee so you can see here i want to give him a employee id 13 and i want to enter my name and i want to select my gender and i want to enter my address and the email id and the phone number and also the organization and also the position so here i just need to select my uh, files which i want to upload like this one and also i will select this and also i will select this again and also i will select this uh, where your file is stored you must have a asset name folder in your google drive our code is automatically fetch the name of the assets folder in our google drive it will search asset name folders and if he if he found the data the images we upload the files we upload save in this folder automatically so I, when i click on the submit so you can see here uploading on the main time in our backend you can see here the file is uploaded here so you can see we up uploaded two files is comes here and also the two more and the one last more is comes here so here you can see our data is saved successfully in our database so we just close this and you can see here the data is successfully come here so when i click on the file icon you will see i will view my uploaded image so if I, if our database is too much large for example if our address or email is large then how the looks become example address is uh, to pay a uh, street 53 uh, 23 house 21 okay so here I will add um, like sample Ali at the rate gmail.com and when I click on the update data so you can see here the data is successfully updated in our uh, database in our grid web app but now what happens you can see a plus icon appears here which shows the mobile responsiveness and the device responsiveness and when you press on this you will see the file 5 and the action buttons also you can apply the search operations from here you can search the data and also you can select the data from how much you want to see on a page 5 entries per page 10 entries per page 25 entries per page and 50 entries per page and 100 entries per page so now back to our code so when you receive this file so you just click on a uh, file and click on make a copy if you see directly a button for make a copy you just hit the make a copy button and after that you will have this kind of sheet in your front in your browser because the sheet is successfully copied in your google drive so just need to click on the extensions and click on the app script when you click on the extensions and the app script the code is pre-applied in your google sheet so make sure where you want to save your file uploads must replace your folder name here okay it automatically check our whole Go your whole google drive and fetch the name of your folder which uh, folder name which you paste it here for example in my case i have assets name folder so it will check in my google drive assets name folder exist 
if the assets folder exists it will save my all the uploaded files in that assets folder okay so here you can see this is our web app now you just need, need to click on the deploy and click on new deployment the complete tutorial on how to set up a google sheet on your and how to install a web app in your computer is available the, the video link available in the description my english is not very well but i try to make my videos in english language so we can reach a broader audience okay so you know uh, here you will select execute me and who has access anyone and now you just need to click on the deploy when you click on the deploy you will give him a permissions to allow after that you will receive this kind of url this url you can add in any wordpress website in any google site website in any kind of website to embed your this web app okay it will work hope you like this video and you can see here this web app have ability to upload five files at a time if you want any customization in this web app our contact in our contact link in the description you can also contact us for your customized projects okay so take care hope you like this video please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon and also press the like and please share your thoughts with us in the comment section i really read your comments and i will be happy to read your comments okay so take care